Good morning, everybody. Welcome to Rise and Shine. You know, the world trains us to think differently. It absolutely trains us to think the way they want us to think. They want us, the whole world wants to define what's right or wrong. The whole world wants you to define what's right or wrong by what they say. But I want you to know, don't let the world define how you think, what you believe is right or wrong, because our standard is the Word of God. The Word of God is my standard on what is right and what is wrong, what is moral, what is immoral, what to do, what not to do. His Word is so powerful. That is our standard. God set the standard. He wrote the Bible years ago so we could have a plan, so we could have a plan to live by and not have to go off into to evilness and sin. In Matthew 24, 35, this is what it says, Heaven and earth will be gone, will pass away, but my word will never pass away. You see, God's word is true, and it's true in your life. Don't let the world define what you think is right or wrong. The Bible tells us what's right or wrong. The Bible tells us that all lives matter. The Bible tells us that he, he died years ago for everyone, not just for one sister. Our God is a mighty God. Let his word define what's right and wrong. Let me pray for you because sometimes we get so confused in this world that we're living in today that we don't even know what's right or wrong. We don't know what's truth from not truth. And sometimes we get terribly confused. So let me pray for healing for your mind. Now let me pray for your body. And let me pray for clarity in your thought process. Oh, Heavenly Father, I just come to you and I just praise you and worship you. But I know your word sets my standard. And your word says I am healed. Your word says that I am full of life. That the same Holy Spirit that raised Jesus from the dead now lives in me. So Lord God, I decree and declare that my body is made whole and healthy. There's no cancer in it. There's no arthritis. All back trouble has to leave in Jesus' name. Our heart disease will have to cure itself in the name of Jesus because of you, Lord God. My heart belongs to you. You make this heart beat properly. You make my mind think clearly. We thank you, Lord God, for healing in our knees and in our muscles and legs. I thank you, Lord God, that diabetes leaves. I thank you, Lord God, that confusion and depression has to leave your mind and clarity comes in. I pray that you have energy and strength and desire to read the Word of God that pulls you ever so close into a mighty, mighty divine God who created heaven and earth and who created you. We love you, Lord God, and we surrender to you and no one else. Amen and amen. Go out and make it a great rise and shine day, and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.